NASA asteroid warning. The USA is not ready for asteroid impact. Millions could be dead in shock demonstration map. Millions of people would die if a rogue asteroid barreled towards the planet struck as the USA is not ready to deal with such an impending threat. This is a shocking NASA report from what they have simulated. Sebastian Ketley of Express UK reports. The National Near-Earth Object Preparedness Strategy and Action Plan report warned an asteroid just 40 to 60 meters across, that is about 120 to 180 feet wide, would be enough to cause unimaginable death and destruction. Dire asteroid impact estimate maps show what would happen if such an asteroid struck in the heart of New York City, for example? Manhattan. The resulting blast would completely level the neighborhoods of Manhattan, the Bronx, Brooklyn, Queens, New Rochelle, Jersey City, and extend into the Staten Island, Patterson, Newark, and White Plains areas. Currently, NASA estimates suggest that there are more than 300,000 objects larger than 40 meters, that's 120 feet across, orbiting the sun that could pose an impact hazard to Earth. NASA's stark map was drafted based on the 1908 Tunguska asteroid, which erupted over Russia with the power of 5 to 10 megatons of TNT. That asteroid explosion was hundreds of times more powerful than the first atomic bomb and wiped out 2,000 square kilometers of forest. And NASA warns there are 10 million near-Earth objects, NEOs, larger than 20 meters, that's 60, me that's 60 feet, and two, that's 25,000 space rocks, at least 140 meters, that's uh, by three, that's 300, 400 feet across in size. 25,000 of them. The report reads, larger NEOs greater than 140 meters have the potential to inflict severe damage to entire regions or even continents. Such objects would strike Earth with a minimum energy of over 60 megatons of TNT, which is more than the most powerful nuclear device ever tested. Fortunately, these are far less common and are easier to detect and track than smaller NEOs. Space rocks up to one kilometer in size are even more lethal and could cause damage on a global scale. But NASA and other US agencies cannot monitor every single small threat flying towards or near the planet. Actually, 90% of them, they do not detect. The Tunguska meteorite, they didn't even know was coming. That was a total surprise. Lindley Johnson, NASA's planetary defense officer, said implementing the action plan is the first step towards effectively responding to asteroid threats. He said, the nation already has significant scientific, technical, and operation capabilities that are relevant to asteroid impact prevention. Implementing the National Near-Earth Object Preparedness Strategy and Action Plan will greatly increase our nation's readiness to work with international partners to effectively respond should a new potential asteroid impact be detected. The action plan suggests the use of kinetic impactors and even nuclear devices as the go-to asteroid threat response. In other words, to nuke them before they can get to us. Amazing facts about asteroids. The first, first asteroid was Ceres, discovered by Giuseppe Piazza in 1801. There are currently over 600,000 known asteroids in our solar system, and most asteroids are found orbiting in the asteroid belt, a series of rings located between the orbits of Mars and Jupiter. Battering ram spacecraft could be used to knock lesser space rocks off their Earth-bound trajectories, but asteroids too big to move would have to be dealt with by more powerful means of destruction. The report said, there is much that is not known about the orbits, size, and material composition of many NEOs and it's essential to account for these uncertainties when developing and utilizing technologies for impact prevention. For example, multiple technologies may be suitable for preventing NEO impacts, 
that are predicted well in advance, while disruption via nuclear explosive device may be the only feasible option for NEOs that are very large or come with short warning time. The U.S. National Science Foundation is now heavily involved in the Chile-based Large Synoptic Survey Telescope, LSST, the giant telescope facility which will scan the skies for asteroids and other moving objects. The powerful telescope will take incredibly detailed snapshots of the night sky to detect changes and potential movement.